hello there so today i'm going to teach you how to configure the fiber one wi-fi extender so have it connected to power source and the next thing you go to your available wi-fi maybe your computer or any other device make sure you don't use the same um you know device you're using to browse at the moment but if you just have one um for the sake of this um tutorial search for the wi-fi to show you fiber one um t45q you know look for it connect to read and um just hold on a bit to take you to the setup page okay here we are here now and once you're here the first thing you do you click on start you insert your password to set up the wi-fi extender which is the first stage um, just get a unique password different from your wi-fi router password so you are repeating the same password here before clicking next um, so you move ahead to the next page where you see repeater please don't change anything click on next and from there quickly um, just wait for the extender to you know scan through the available wi-fi uh, which of course your own wi-fi will also be part of what will show up here um, just give it a little um, time and then boom we are here so by the time you're here do well to click on your wi-fi for example now i'm clicking on fiber one um hq the way you're as you're seeing here on the screen and uh, sometimes it will allow you to click to continue um, but if you get to where you can't where you're seeing that the um they say please select the 5g uncheck it and then click on next um, but for me i can do this um, i can leave it like that and we'll click on next um, but if your own is not allowing you make sure you click you uncheck that 5g and click on next so by the time you're here insert your password um, to the router so don't insert the password you created for the wi-fi extender in the previous page so this place has to do with your wi-fi password so once you're done click on next it will pop up here so from here now you can decide to change the name of your wi-fi for example i can say fiber one hq extended or i can say fiber one extended um to make sure that you can be able to identify that oh this is the extender or this is the main router uh, make sure it's the same password don't make any mistake if not it's not going to be connected so click on next uh, click on save uh, so once you click on save just give it some time so uh it is, you will see that your extender is now blinking blue um just give it some time most times it will take you off this page automatically um once it's connected and the blue light stops blinking it's okay to exit this page just go to the available wi-fi and search for read um then you see that you see the fiber one extended there that i renamed renamed it to when i was configuring the extender so i renamed the extender to fiber one extended so i can be able to differentiate that oh this is the um, wi-fi extender so i will insert the password of the router of your main fiber one um, router not the extender i hope you understand so don't don't put the password of your extender insert the password of the fiber one router the main router now so that um, that indicates that you've connected or configured the Wi-Fi extender to your Fiber One um, Wi-Fi router at home. So we are good to go. So the next thing you just go to your browser, search for your um, anything you do, your Netflix and the lights. Um, just have fun. If you have any other um, challenge through this process, you can always reach us um, via our social platforms and our WhatsApp as well to get adequate support for for your extender as well do have a lovely experience using the fiber one wi-fi extender <music>